It's a massive few days coming up in Melbourne. Australia find themselves on the brink. Two defeats and staring Ashes defeat straight in the eye. The English have all the momentum and will believe that this is their time to silence the critics. Can they take the series three to nothing? I'm Mike Atherton and with me for this exciting contest is Mel Jones, Ali Mitchell, Ian Healy and the one and only Lord Gower. Hi Mike, thanks for that intro. Earlier I took a look at the conditions for the day and the grand staff have done a magnificent job on the pitch. I think if I was the captain I'd be having a bowl. Try and make the most of whatever movement there is. Beautiful clear conditions and not a chance of rain. Nice information there from David Gower. It looks like the captains are ready for the toss. Let's go pitch side. The captain, choosing to bowl first, will hope to take full advantage of these conditions. Should be plenty to get the bowlers interested. The two openers will need to keep their wits about them. First day of this match. Please welcome the players and umpires as they take to the field. The umpire sig A lot of pressure coming to the crease. Not had the best of weeks leading up to this game and will want to show everyone their strength. What a shot. First ball smashed it. That ball has been hit. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward on the front foot is ridiculous. Cummins, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. What? Brilliant diving stop. Misses out there on the short and wide one. Ooh, Misses everything. Following. Just need to settle down. The timing's off. These deliveries are there to be hit. Time for call heads. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. That sees the completion of the over. A good one too. Not many opportunities to score. Wait. Quick onto that in the infield. Well, not a great delivery, got it full. Lucky not to be hit to the boundary. Couldn't yes. have played that any better. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there was no point chasing that.
That last ball isn't something you'd want to see a repeat of. You don't want to be giving easy runs away. Oh. Nice, Boy. solid defensive shot. Just slowing things down, nothing too risky on that delivery. Is keeping the bowler honest. End of the over. Labuschagne from the members' end. Yep, yep. Flew away with pace, brilliant timing. Fine placement and enough timing to get that ball away to the boundary. I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Ooh, got right in behind it. Ah, negated the spin well then. Got nicely on top of the bounce. Yep. That's right out of the middle of the bat. That was timed very, very well. Great shot. Driven down the ground and flew over the boundary. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have been really happy with that last shot. That was a good slow ball. Picked up well, though. Got that defensive shot in, nice and simple. Wait! Into the gap, nice yes. shot. It was just a little bit too full, and it was beautifully timed. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder after the boundary. Ooh, well Solid defence, very compact. Right over the top of it, nicely smothering the spin there. England weren't given much of an opportunity, a very tidy over. Stark, the left arm pace bowler, is coming into the attack from the great southern stand. They'll push hard, should get back for two. A couple on offer here. Good return, back from the deep. Great shot through the gap. Roll up. Onto the front foot and punched it nicely. Would have hoped to find the rope. Five runs added in that over. England are three for 119. Green into the attack now, from the members' end. Wait there. Finds the fielder with that shot. Short and wide, did well to get some bat on that. Wait! 
Not a great delivery, got it full and lucky not to be hit to the boundary. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Crawley shakes their head. It was there to be hit, but couldn't make the most of it. That's the over. England are three for 120. times it nicely. There was minimal follow-through, just great timing to punch it through the field for four. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? Wait in. Yeah! Big shout. Right out of the middle. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early and it was dispatched with a plum. Crawley has got the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Couldn't get it through the field. Waiting. Eight runs added there. England are three for 138. Drives and misses everything. Green with a superb delivery. Got them trying to drive, but messing everything up. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Right there. That's the end of the over, one run coming from it. England are three for 139. Wow, that's missed a lot. Not a great shot in the end. Practices the shot again. Just need to keep their head down now. Misses out there on the short and wide one.
Short and wide. Did well to get some bat on that. The end of a tidy over. Batting doesn't seem to be easy out there at the moment. Good pressure building. Absolutely nailed it. Off the front foot, hit it with all the power and elegance of a batter right at the top of their game. It can be very disheartening seeing good deliveries smacked around. Sometimes you've just got to accept it and move on. Effortless. A gift, really. Floated it up there and dealt with. Found the gap with ease. Wasn't the worst ball you'll see, but it's still raced to the rope. Crawley is really starting to get on top of this bowling. May need a few changes to halt this momentum. Great yes. shot, great timing. And that brings up the half century for this they haven't messed about, brings up a rapid 50, hasn't let any of the bowlers settle. Don't mind getting hit for runs. What's important is to focus on getting the next ball right. Ooh. Well, that wow. was just an awesome delivery. Whiz past the batsman, the umpire says that's the first of two. Right off the middle of the bat. Managed to get onto the front foot early and just incredible power to loft that one over the boundary. Giving them absolutely nothing here at the moment. Another over gone and not much from it. Gave them very little in that over, one run added. England are three for 164. Doesn't beat the infield. A little late on that, no run scored. Yes. Good shot, it's found the gap. Just perfection, a majestic shot. You just cannot hit it any better than that. Raced away to the boundary. You can see how good this pitch can be for batting. You want the player coming forward, but it's a tight margin. Only a touch full and put away. Yeah. Can't get that outside the ring field. Obviously didn't like the look of that one and just ignored it. End of the over, four off it. England are three for 168.
Wait. Maybe they didn't pick that up very late on the shot. Wait. Crawley shakes their head. It was there to hit, couldn't make the most of it. Wait! Cuts that off well in the infield. Wait! Waiting. Hazelwood has had a pretty good over. Just needed a bit more luck to find a wicket. Oh. Beaten on the drive. Wow. That's wild. Nothing elegant about that shot. Just not timing it at all, it's poor play. Oh. A bit of frustration after that shot, went after it, but just couldn't lay a bat on it. Cummins ends what has been a tidy over, just needed to top it off with a wicket. Lyon with the ball in hand again. Super shot that. You could see by how it whistled away to the boundary just how sweetly this was timed. Lion shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots, just need to tighten their areas okay. now. Does very well to get quickly across to that one. Ooh. Misses everything. Oh, wow. Yes. Time that brilliantly. Just missed the line, not the worst delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watch that in awe. A good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball, and it'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Yes! That's right out of the middle of the bat. With shots like that, it's not going to be long before the hundred is up. That was a really well-timed stroke. Yep. 
they'll get at least one. Gavers end! There'll be one run here for them. Lion from the great southern stand end. Yes. Just about time that perfectly. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there's no point in chasing that. A little short on that occasion. Needs to adjust the length slightly to be just a little fuller. Too short on this pitch. Oh, and as we've seen already, it makes it very easy to score. Just slowing oh. things down. Nothing too risky on that delivery. Just keeping the bowler honest. Yep. Ease through the field. There'll be oh. runs here. Misses out there on the short and wide one. Onto the front foot, super shot, should be four. Onto the front foot early, placed it perfectly into the gap, timed it nicely for four more. Getting nicely settled at the crease now, would have been really happy with that last shot. Mightn't get to the boundary, should at least get a couple. Had all the time in the world to get in position to play that ball. Timed it nicely for four runs. Cummins, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Over. England are four for 213. Stark with a superb delivery. Got them trying to drive, but messing everything up. Flew away with pace, brilliant timing. Four runs, they were so still at the crease, just a slight movement forward, fabulous shots. Do they go full, do they go short? A lot to ponder after the boundary. They've picked the gap. Perfect timing. 
caress that nicely through the gap to the boundary. Consecutive boundaries in this over. I wonder what plans they'll come up with to slow this batting. Oh, didn't get the feet moving. Played down the wrong line, threw the hands at it, got nothing on the ball. Following. Well, that's a wild one. Nothing elegant about that shot, just not timing it at all. Poor play. Yep. Lovely timing. Will this one go to the fence? A huge roar around the ground. It's the 100 up. A brilliant performance. They'll raise their back to the crowd. A fabulous century. Scored at a blistering pace too. Got off to a brilliant start and just kept going. Got right in behind it. That was a good slower ball. Picked up well, though. Got that defensive shot in, nice and simple. Beautiful slower delivery. Just hitting air on that one. That was just too good. Right there. Straight to the fielder. Just the one run off the over. England are four for 226. The right armour is coming on. Well placed, should get a single. Great shot through the gap. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played, and it was four runs all the way. Crawley has got the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Wait. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. I think that's called for the front foot. Not by much, but that doesn't matter. Didn't keep the foot behind the line. Just a slight tweak to the run-up will sort it out. Yep, yep. Saw that early. No one's catching that. Great shot. That's a very difficult shot to get right. Straight back at the bowler with a lot of pace and the covering fielder had no chance.
tried for something a bit different the last ball. The captain shouldn't mind that. If they get it right, they might just get the wicket. Right there. Quick onto that in the infield. Wow, that's missed a lot. Questions will begin to be asked. Should the captain make a change? A big over that one. Too many loose deliveries. Yep. Great shot. At least one on offer. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. That's the over. England are four for 244. Yes. Nicely played. Threaded it through brilliantly. All timing on that shot. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? Great shot, yep, yep. but it's not going to beat the fielder. It just looks so easy. Gets onto the front foot and eases through the ball. They can just stand and admire that shot. A boundary off the last ball. Is it a sign they're trying to push the run rate? Yes. Great shot through the gap. Perfect timing. Well, that was a very solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. They shouldn't get too discouraged with that last ball. The first step as a bowler is to get the batter playing, which they've managed. If they can find the right spot, the reward will eventually come. That is a masterclass of batting. Reads the length, gets forward and dispatches it to the boundary. Don't mind getting hit for runs. What's important is to focus on getting the next ball right. Right there. Couldn't get it through the field. Waiting. The over comes to an end. Not many runs coming from it. Both sides need to inject some life into this game. Yes! Right off the middle of the bat. Managed to get onto the front foot early and just incredible power to loft that one over the boundary. End of the over. England are four for 267. The right arm medium bowler is coming. Got that away nicely. And that takes us by the shift to 100 runs. 
You can see how good this pitch can be for batting. You want the player coming forward, but it's a tight margin. Only a touch full and put away. Finds the fielder with that shot. Five runs in that over. England are four for 270. Nice, solid defensive shot. Into the yes. gap, nice shot. Found the gap with ease, wasn't the worst ball you'll see, but it's still raced to the rope. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key. Wait! Waiting! Yep, yep. Picks the gap perfectly. There was minimal follow-through, just great timing to punch it through the field for four. That's the 150. It's been a very, very good innings. I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Solid defence, very compact. End of the over, eight runs coming from it. England are four for 281. Cummins, the pace bowler, coming into the attack. Yes! Really good shot there. Picked up four with a lovely shot off the front foot. That last ball isn't something you'd want to see a repeat of. You don't want to be giving easy runs away. Wait. Can't get that outside the ring field. Oh. Misses everything. Misses out there on the short and wide one. Right there. Strokes yep, yep. it languidly away to the fence. A lovely shot. Not needed. A poor line and length. Not much effort needed to hit that to the boundary. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball, but you just got to stay positive and believe the wicket will come. Yes. Great timing, right off the meat of the bat. 
Those types of deliveries, if you make the most of them, the bowler will feel the pressure. What else do they have in their bag of tricks? Not much seems to be working at the moment. Cummins has had a pretty good over. Just needed a bit more luck to find a wicket. Lion from the great... Yes. Perfect technique and placement. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there was absolutely no point in chasing that. A good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball, and it'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Yep, yep. Brilliant shot, that. Fine placement and enough timing to get that ball away to the boundary. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Not a great delivery, got it full and lucky not to be hit to the boundary. Ooh. Well, another chance to bowl that one. Really can't have been by much though. It looked a pretty good delivery, to be honest. Umpire, though, has given it as a wide. Yes! Nice! Well, a lovely shot. Really good timing out of the middle, and it raced to the boundary. End of the over. Seven runs coming from it. England are four for 311. Perfectly yes. timed. Doesn't even ball's going to do anything. Onto the front foot, punches it away to the boundary. It can be very delivery smacked around. Sometimes you've just got to accept it and move on. Yep. Very quick out there, managing to stop it and preventing four runs.
drives and misses everything. Cummins with a superb delivery. Got them trying to drive, but messing everything up. Yep, That's yep. right out of the middle of the bat. That went all the way up toward the grandstand for four, driven away nicely. Cummins shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots, just need to tighten their areas now. Yep. That's off the middle of the bat. It was just a little bit too full and it was beautifully timed. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder after the boundary. Good shot, it's found the gap. There'll be one run here for them. A brilliant throw in from the deep caps off what was a fabulous piece of fielding. End of the over, ten runs coming from. That's wild. Nothing elegant about that shot. Just not timing it at all. It's poor play. Yep, yep. Middle that one. Great timing. No trouble at all to punch it away to the boundary for four. A poor delivery. Five runs added there. England are four for 332. Start. The left arm pace bowler is coming. Wait. Cuts that off well in the infield. Misses out there on the short and wide one. Good bit of timing there. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played and it was four runs all the way. Tried for something a bit different, the last ball. The captain shouldn't mind that. If they get it right, they might just get the wicket. Oh. Oh. A bit of frustration after that shot. Went after it, but just couldn't lay a bat on it. Wait. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Wow, that's missed a lot. Australia found some good rhythm in that over. They'll want to maintain it going forwards. Wait! Crawley shakes their head. It was there to be hit, but couldn't make the most of it. A lovely shorter ball, just keeping them honest. Still got a chance to use another one in this over. Waiting. Straight to the fielder. Oh. 
beaten on the drive. End of the over, seven off it. England are five for three. Doesn't beat the infield. Oh, that was a tremendous delivery. Fizz through to the keeper. No more short balls this over. The over ends with no change to the scoring after some superb... Well, that was just an awesome delivery. Whizzed past the batter and the umpire says that's the first of two. Couldn't get it through the field. Waiting. Crawley shakes their head. It was there to hit, couldn't make the most of it. That ball oh, no. just fizzed off the pitch. A superb delivery, although they can't do any more short stuff this over. Right there. Quick onto that in the infield. End of the over. England are five for 349. Yes. Just about time that perfectly. And that brings up their double century. This has been a demonstration of high class batting. 200 runs, marvellous. Finds the fielder with that shot. Yep, yep. Right off the middle of the bat. Well, this is why you need to be so precise as a bowler. Didn't do much wrong, but it's been hammered for four anyway.
don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key. Wait! No interest in that one from the batter. Stark will be wanting to hone in on a better line and length to make them play next time. End of the over. Eight off it. England are five for 361. Green coming on. Obviously... Excellent catch, close to the bat. Well, a wonderful innings comes to an end. Hit the ball to all parts of the ground, really put the bowlers to the sword. Won't, won't have the pressure of facing up just yet. The nerves... Lots of pressure coming into bat. We'll have to wait, though, to face their first ball. Yep. Great shot through the gap. Crawley got it into the gap, and the ball did the rest. Brilliant shot. I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Waiting. Picks the gap perfectly. Okay. Didn't need to bother about running with timing like that. A boundary off the last ball. Is it a sign they're trying to push the run rate? Yes. Great shot. Placement exquisite. It was full, and good night. Hit it well to pick up four. Crawley has got the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Wait. Does very well to get quickly across to that one. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. Yep. Great shot through the gap. Perfect timing. Came forward onto the front foot and eased it away to the boundary. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length, around about off stump, and that'll force the mistake. Yes! Into the gap, nice shot. A couple on offer here. That's the end of the over, just magical batting. Nothing the bowler can do but watch as the ball...
Can't get that outside the ring field. This is everything. Yep, yep. Good shot. A beauty. There was minimal follow through, just great timing to punch it through the field for four. Some well targeted bowling in that over. Certainly something to build on. Star coming back into the attack. Into the attack for Australia. Bowling. Yes. That's great fielding. That ball was flying. Green from the great southern stand end. Waiting. Yes. Couldn't have played that any better. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early and it was dispatched with aplomb. The last one helped the scoring rate, making their intentions clear. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Yep. Times it nicely. And that brings up the 50 partnership for these two. That's the 50 partnership between these two, gaining some momentum nicely for the team. Getting nicely settled at the crease now would have been really happy with that last shot. Wait. Threw the hands at it, somehow missed everything. Well, they never really got in the right position for the drive for that one, a bit of... Nicely played. Got the head right in line with the ball. A beautiful strike there, down the ground. They shouldn't get too discouraged with that last ball. The first step as a bowler is to get the batter playing, which they've managed. If they can find the right spot, the reward will eventually come. Brilliant diving stop. Yep. Great shot. Well, that was a really solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. Don't mind getting hit for runs. What's important is to focus on getting the next ball right. Yes. That's right off the meat of the bat. 
Found the gap with ease. Wasn't the worst ball you'll see, but it's still raced to the rope. You can see how good this pitch can be for batting. You want the player coming forward, but it's a tight margin. Only a touch full and put what? away. Green has really kept the pressure on in this over. Just needs to maintain the momentum going forwards. Hit that well off the back foot, but couldn't beat the field. Over. England are three for 90. Hazelwood, the right armour, is coming into the attack from the members' end. Drives and misses everything. Hazelwood with a superb delivery. Got them trying to drive, but messing everything up. Thought it got past them, but a fantastic dive to cut it off. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. <gasps> well, that was just an awesome delivery. Whiz past the batsman. The umpire says that's the first of two. Good yes. shot, it's found the gap. Now that was beautifully struck with a perfect straight bat. Cummins, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. They'll push hard, okay. should get back for two. And that brings up 50 runs for this batter. Really good innings to bring up the half century. Impressive batting, and they'll want to. Time that brilliantly. You could see by how it whistled away to the boundary just how sweetly this was timed. A good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball, and it'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. There'll be runs here. Good cricket all round, good delivery, time well, but straight to the fielder. Nice timing, good batting, won't get to the boundary. Good throw from the deep, on target. A little flick of the wrist to get it round the corner for an easy run. Yep, yep. They'll get at least one. Hey, There'll be one run here for them.
Wait. Straight to the fielder. Got right in behind it. Middle that one, great timing. Caress that nicely through the gap to the boundary. That's the over. England are three for 110. Doesn't beat the infield. A little late on that, no run scored. A lovely shorter ball, just keeping them honest. Still got a chance to use another one in this over. Wow, that's missed a lot. That's wild. Nothing elegant about that shot. Just not timing it at all. It's poor play. Yep, yep. Super shot. What a lovely shot. Really good timing out of the middle and it raced to the boundary. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball, but you just gotta stay positive and believe the wicket will come. Waiting. Quick onto that in the infield. Crawley shakes their head. It was there to be hit, but couldn't make the most of it. Brilliant yes. shot that. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played, and it was four runs all the way. Great shot, but it's not going to beat the fielder. Power. Good return, back from the deep. Nice, solid defensive shot. Ah, negated the spin well then. Got nicely on top of the bounce. Yes. Well placed. Should get a single. Wait! 
finds the fielder with that shot. Umpire signals wide, such a poor delivery. Really need to work out what actually went wrong there. Well, he took all the pace off it. The response was good, actually. It was met very solidly with a very straight bat. End of the over, three off it. England are three for 126. Going with pace now. Into the attack for Australia. A lovely shorter ball, just keeping them honest. Still got a chance to use another one in this over. Yep, yep. Nicely played, perfect timing. Crawley says thank you. It was a gift and they smashed it away to the boundary rope. Cummins shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots, just need to tighten their areas now. Yep. They've picked the gap, perfect timing. A couple on offer here. Good throw from the deep, on target. Couldn't get it through the field. It was a nice looking shot, full and in the slot, just couldn't find the gap. Ooh. Misses everything. Not a great shot in the end. Practices the shot again. Just need to keep their head down now. Nine runs added in that over. England are three for 135. Can't get that outside the ring field. Not a great delivery, got it full and lucky not to be hit to the boundary. Wait! That's yep. right out of the middle of the bat. No trouble at all to punch it away to the boundary for four. A poor delivery. A little short on that occasion. Needs to adjust the length slightly to be just a little fuller. Too short on this pitch. And as we've seen already, it makes it very Waiting. easy to score. Great shot, at least one on offer. This could be out. Exquisitely down the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive. Could have been worth more.
End of the over, a good one in terms of keeping the batters quiet. Just needed to take a wicket to make it an excellent one. Lion. Well, that's perhaps a little harsh. I felt it wasn't that wide. Ooh, that was a tremendous delivery. Fizzed through to the keeper. No more short balls this over. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Wait. Yep, yep. Right out of the middle. Got it well enough to get it away to the boundary, a poor delivery and a fine shot in the end. I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Yep. They'd look for a couple here. Fine placement and enough timing to get that ball away to the boundary. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? Yes. Can't bowl there. Too full and helped on its way. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early and it was dispatched with a plomb. Really playing all their shots that over. Really expensive. The right arm medium bowler is coming on to bowl from the members' end. Wait. Wait. Nicely yeah. taken. Quick to latch on to it. Starting to get interesting now. That's the fifth wicket. And a very frustrated person is heading back to the pavilion. And with that wicket, the new batter will mark their guard. We might be looking at some changes in the Australian lineup for the next match. Nothing seemed to be working for them in this match. England winning convincingly. That's all from us in the commentary box. It's been an amazing match. Hope to see you soon.